to another video. Today we are doing the Valentine's Day house tour. This is why I'm standing at the bottom of my stairs and it's really cold by the front door. So I thought I'd show you from the front door up to my living area. So let's get into the video. So on the front door we have red hot cutie stuff, little heart love hearts and then this is a diy wreath which i will link below for you guys to have a go at i don't know what this is i think this is some random thing that's on our door and then we also have hug me and be mine little love heart stickers so this is what the door looks like with all its valentine's day gear on Also, as you walk in through the front door, there's this welcome mat. And then as you work your way up the stairs, ignore Charlie's shoes, we have pom-poms going up the banister, which looks super cool. And then we also have um, more pom-poms on the Mr. and Mrs. sign above the keys. By the way, I thought I'd mention that I will do a evening tour as well. So it'll be day to night, um, just so you can see the lights a bit better rather than during the day. Anyway, let's continue the tour. Then over on the map, we also have some lights. And then in the hallway, also on the map, we've got some more love heart sticker type things. These were actually a banner that I took apart and decided to stick them on the doors and stuff. So it's on this shoe cupboard door. There's more hearts as well. Before we move on to the rest of the hallway, I thought I would just give you a quick tour of the kitchen as this has the least decorations in. So we've got the Love Hearts banner going along the splashback. And then as you work your way around the kitchen, sorry about the light and the sun's shining today. We've got these love heart glasses, which we'll be using on Valentine's Day. And then we also have these drumstick squashies hand wash. So this is what it looks like all together. You can't really see the glasses, but yeah, they're just a little, little bit of decoration for the festive period sorry about my messy kitchen like we use it every day so i couldn't bother to clean it moving back into the hallway we have my bedroom door which also has some heart stickers on i will go into the bedroom but there isn't much in there so in the bedroom it's very messy along here just ignore that so for the bedroom, we've literally just got pink bedding on the bed to make it a bit more festive. And I definitely brought the pink bed and the pink curtains for Valentine's Day reasons. As you come out of the bedroom, so this door here is the bedroom. This is the living room and that's the bathroom. So the living room has the most decorations. So I'm going to leave that one till last. So moving ahead to the bathroom again there is more love heart stickers on the door to make it really festive and then as you come in there is some love hearts soaps and then also over here there is some love hearts um bath and shower gel and this actually we've used this as you can see as you can see here we've used quite a lot of it and it literally smells like love hearts it's amazing um so yeah that's her little theme in here so there's not much in the bathroom but this is what it looks like from the bathroom view if you were curious and then going on to the living room the main event so on the doors we've got two banners door banners and then the hearts again 
on the door. If you're thinking of getting these banners, they are a bit of a pain to put together, but once they're put together, I feel like they're well worth it. So let's go into the living room. So this is what it looks like as a whole. You can't see it as much because we're in daylight. So I'm just going to walk around the room and show you what we have up. So first thing you see as you enter is this love sign and the main event, the TV. So I'm going to walk this way. And so this is the happy Valentine's Day sign above the TV. So this is the view from if you're sitting and watching telly. So we have the Valentine's Day love sign with the two love plaques next to it. We have the, on top of the TV, we have some more pom-pom lights. And then going a bit closer, we have on the TV stand. So the games behind are couple quiz and couples Jenga which we're gonna play on Valentine's Day. And then we have a Valentine's Day blackboard with Valentine's Day on. I've also added these Love Heart tea lights and Love Heart sweets to the TV stand, as well as one of my favorite objects, these little love gnomes. I just thought they were super cute. And then again, you can't see this in daylight, but we have um, a Love Hearts banner, the Sweets banner going across the unit, which lights up at night. So as a whole, this is what the TV stand looks like. Like it's one of my favourite themed, I think, at the minute. I'm just obsessed with the way it looks. Let me know what you think below. And just to give you a little close up, this is the other plaque which says hug me on it. Moving around to the windowsill, we have a kiss me light, which you can't really see because the sun has decided to shine. And then we also have some love heart tea lights, the love sign, and then also another kiss me sign. And then as I pull away, you will be able to see love hearts hanging from the curtain pole. I don't think you'll be able to see these. I've literally picked the worst day to film this video. But there's, they're actually different colours, as you can see. There's pink, red and a darker pink. And then the ones on top are pink, um, are red and white. So they were super cute finds. Then moving around, we have this little coffee table over here, which, yes, I still got Santa Percy pigs, but I thought they would go because they're pink. And I just added these pom-pom tea lights and also a Love Bug Ray Dunn mug, which I'm obsessed with. Moving around the room, on my Paris picture, I've added more pom-poms. So this is what the living room looks like from this angle. Just to give you a little bit of a view. I will do the same when it's dark, like I said. And then also on this wall here, we have added some pom-pom lights to this picture frame. And I have also added some more Love Heart Sweets to the radiator. I nearly forgot to mention that I added some Love Heart coasters to both my coffee tables in the living room. So that's everything for the time being. Now we just gotta wait till it gets dark and then I will do the whole experience again for you. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Just letting Nala out because she's Look at her, listen to her. What do you want now? Go on, go. Bye. Right, so I'm at the bottom of the stairs, the light's going off, and this is what it looks like. 
So this is the door heart, which is super cozy. So you can't really see anything else, any of the other decorations because it's too dark. And then as you go up the stairs, there's all the lights. So these are the pom-pom lights going up the banister, all nice and lit up and cozy. Then up here is the lights by the keys and then the lights by the map. This is what the hallway looks like downstairs if you're looking down from the top. So it's nice and cozy. So that's all the lights in the hallway. And then if we go into the living room and as we come into the living room, it looks like this. So the TV has loads of lights on it. So I like the candles, but I don't like the ones in the between. Then we've got the light up suites at the bottom, the lights on top of the TV and that's it. So as you can see, it's very dark. And then as we go round to the windowsill, we have the kiss me light, which you can just about see. My Mickey light, the love sign light, this light, and this kiss me light keeps going off for some reason, but it's actually on and you can't see it. If anyone knows a fix for that, let me know, but yeah, it should look like this one. Like you can just about see it. Just. Whereas this one, it doesn't even look like it's on. So yeah, not too impressed with them. Then moving on to the table. So this is just got the pom-pom fairy lights on. And then on the mirror, not the mirror, do I have a mirror? On the picture canvas art, we have the lights. Then on my picture frame, we have lights. And then at the bottom, we also have lights. So that's what it looks like in the dark. And then just a little reminder of what it looks like with the candles on. And just looks all cozy. I just love it. I'm absolutely obsessed. Like seeing the light in the dark... <laughs> See, in the dark, you can't even see them kiss me lights. They're a bit naff, so I wouldn't recommend them. I am on the hunt next year for some more of these. So if you know where to get me get them, let me know in the comments below. But we also have a loose, the cat. And yeah, I just think it's nice and cosy. So I hope you like this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Let me know in the comments below if you know where I can get some kiss me lights or love heart, loves, love heart signs. And that would really make my day because I thought they would be better than that and they're not. All the other stuff I picked up, I absolutely love. So yeah, there's two things that I'm not a fan of. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching guys. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe for more spontaneous content and I'll see you in my next one guys. Bye!